and this is a day in the life of me as a civil engineering intern. Uh, so on a day-to-day -day basis, I'd be mostly subjected to the south side of the project, which is where it runs one to five. And there's three major site agents that are working on the site, and I'll be helping them up and um, shadowing them throughout. Um, so some tasks that I would do is like supervising the health and safety and the installing of the utilities underground. We have these uh, CEs, which are compensation events, um, and you have to record everything that's happening and any like mistake that we might have to pay for or something that wasn't expected to happen. Like digging too far down in a trench for excavation, uh, that can be extra money and it just adds up. So a lot of the times I'll take out and I'll measure the hole that was dug, um, both width and the depth of it, and I'll draw a sketch of it, and then see um, how much extra excavation was done. And each amount is contributed to the amount of money. Um, there's also uh, so we'll have, we have like sheets of what is su supposed to be reinforced on the, the roads and the sidewalks. So I'll have to measure what, was, what has been reinforced and what hasn't. And then, because they're expecting everything to be reinforced, so if everything hasn't, then it's saving us money or it's gonna add to our costs in the end. Well, a lot of times I'll take pictures of sites, so progress reports and Stuff like that. And if I'm on, if I'm in the office, I'll be filling out um, like sheets of bill, bill quantities. Um, I'll be looking over the CEs and filling them out in like an organized format. So I usually work till about five every day, and then I uh, go to the gym here, and then afterwards, just I always, I'm a big fan of cooking my own meals, so I do spend it quite a bit more money than anyone else at the grocery store, but um, it's definitely um, something I like doing. And so, working in an office, um, it's definitely, I feel like I get more of the actual culture, the Irish culture, than, than a person just studying abroad, because mostly kids that come abroad studying will just be with other kids from their school, so they'll be with like other Americans if they're coming over from there, but here, um, alone, the alone American working with all the Irish, so it's really cool to work with them. Um, definitely in a construction office, you learn to be open with what you say. Um, swearing is a second nature. Um, and then it's just, it's really interesting to see how like, Ireland's such a small country, but um, there's so many different accents. I definitely come back to Ireland. Um, I know like, after this, I want to go on to grad school, but I would like, in a perfect world, I would like to defer a year to be able to work. Um, and Ireland is definitely an option if I have that, that choice to have a year off in between undergrad and graduate school, or even after graduate school, it might take a few years to travel abroad and, and, and work. And, uh, and here is definitely an option for that. Life of me, thanks for stint, right? Can it happen? I'll be back. I'll be back. <laughs>